Hello friends, in this video I will show you how to use proximity sensor in Sketchware. So let's start. Here I will be using three text views. This will be for the gyroscope X, Y and Z. I will just increase the size of these three to 30. And here I will use one more text view for counting the number of times the sensor detects an object. For this I will set the text size to 50 and the text style to bold. So this is text view 4 and these are text view 1, 2 and 3. Now here I will add a gyroscope component called gyro. Now here my device doesn't have any gyroscope component. Now in on activity create, I will first use this block gyroscope sensor stop and after this I will use an add source directly block and here I will register the proximity sensor. To register the proximity sensor, I will have used this code gyro dot register listener, gyro sensor listener. This is the name of the listener, comma gyro dot get default sensor, sensor dot type underscore proximity, sensor manager dot sensor delay game. Now here this gyro and this second gyro, these two gyro are name of the gyroscope component. Here you can see the name of the gyroscope component. So these two codes means these two gyro are the same. If the name of gyroscope component is different, it has to be changed here. Next I will go to components and here I will add gyroscope on sensor changed and in this I will set the text of text view 1. text view 2 and text view 3. The text will be set as the string form of these x, y and z. So I will just copy this for text view 2 and text view 3. Now these text view 1 will be x text view 2 will be y and text view 3 will be z. Now here I will use one more number variable to count the number of times the sensor detects an object. For text view 4, whenever on sensor change detects an object, whenever the proximity sensor detects an object, this count will increase by 1 and it will be displayed in text view 4. Now let's check this. Okay, here is this proximity sensor app and it initially shows minus 90, minus 90, minus 90 and 0. And when I pass my hand over the proximity center sensor, it, it shows minus 180, 90, 0 and it increases the count by 2. Every time I pass my hand, it increases the count. Means once my hand is over it and once my hand is away from it, it increases by 1. So when my hand is over it, x changes to minus 180, y changes to 90 and z changes to 0. I can use this in my coding to do something when the it detects something. And when my hand is away, means when the sensor is not detecting anything, then x is y and z, all three are minus 90. So that's all in this video. I hope this will be useful. Thank you very much for watching this.